Hello, my name is Nicholas Seglia. I am in Introduction to Film and Video, Section 4, and this is my 4.1 reflection, um, I guess you can call final, um, for this course. The thing that I found most valuable in the course, um, just personally speaking, is the fact that we went into depth of more of the, a little bit of pre-filming and also some of the actual things that go on before filming such as um the storyboarding treatments i didn't even i never even thought about treatments um let alone the script writing honestly um to me personally i i would think treatments would be made along with script writing um however i digress and I just I just really love the fact that all these dots are going to connect in the next class of script writing and how learning more of that process is going to make things for me at least click just a little bit better um for my progress into growing as a filmmaker um and the things that I'm looking forward to most in the DCBS program is honestly I probably just I want to see how much I grow as a filmmaker anything from just small content creation if I decide to upload more stuff onto YouTube or um, just as I just really want to see how I progress and how I change things up as I go through these courses and these portfolio projects that's the thing i'm excited about the most though is the portfolio projects do solely to because that's allowing us to give or to get creative freedom um to actually test our abilities to actually give it to somebody else to grade and to critique without having a biased opinion As far as goals after um, the completion of this program, I'm probably going to start off doing something as simple as wedding videography. Um, that's just because it's something simple. I, I really do enjoy weddings. Um, it's somewhat popular in the state of Florida to be a wedding videographer. I can make a decent living and I can just do other stuff on the side. Um, I, I like I like making content to make people happy and to make memories with. And with weddings, that's a perfect fit. Honestly, they want to have those videos to look back on and um, just be happy and remember those that day. And if I get my foot in the door somewhere else, say with um, a small film company, like right now, me and a couple of people are trying to make a Demon Slayer spin-off film um, but that's been kind of put off for a hot minute now <laughs> um, and honestly I'm just kind of winging it if I'm gonna be honest um, whatever whatever comes first happens and if I find more love in actually doing and creating my own films then i'll do that if not i can just run with the boating videography or something like that or try to actually go youtube full-time or something i don't know and i i hope to expand more on the stuff for my portfolio projects through actually taking time and the more I learn the more I want to put into like things such as my treatment I want to go back into those and re readjust them um, to try and get something that's not only right because I know mine wasn't exactly perfect um, however um, I do want to actually make something that is worth actually watching and maybe even have it come up as an example 